Hi Stampers! I'm Meg from Love and Stamps and I have another Stamps Mail Club card to share with you. This one is another Acorny Thank You card which uses the Acorn stamp set which has some also um, dropping by to say hi kind of words which is cute. It goes along with a pun which makes me happy. So anyway this is a um, fun card and uses some of the punch um, layering pieces in different ways. So let me give you some tips on how to use this Acorn punch to create some different effects and layer your pieces. So let's get stamping. So for this card, we're going to start with our piece of crumb cake and fold it in half. And if you have trouble with your cardstock moving, you might want to um, go ahead and unfold it in half while you're doing your stamping. Or otherwise, make sure it's flat on the paper so you're flat on your table so it's not um, sliding and giving you a, a moving target for stamping, basically. So I am going to just stamp a number of these acorns and then... I'm going to um, mix up the caps a little bit. Let's see, there's one that's crosshatchy one. We'll make this one crosshatchy too. And then I think I want a polka dot one. Okay, all right. So when you've got your acorn stamped, then we can start to assemble. This is a piece of the Into the Woods designer series paper. So not only do I love the show Into the Woods, like the musical production, I still haven't seen the movie. So if you love the movie and you think I should see it, I guess leave me a comment. But uh, the musical production, the Sondheim production I love. And then I'm going to grab a circle here and stamp our um, dropping by to say hi. I guess it doesn't matter if I stamp it upside down or not, right? Dropping in, dropping in to say hi. Um, which of course needs a Stampin' Dimensional on the back because everything needs a Stampin' Dimensional, right? Now when I orient this, the word hi is crooked, the word dropping in to say, they're very straight. So make sure you line up your dropping in to say with the vertical and horizontal lines on your paper and the hi is sort of that like scripty, flowy off to the side. Okay, your acorn pieces will be pre-punched for you if you um, have your Stamps the Mail Club piece, or if you have the extra paper and you want to just punch them yourself because you added the bundle, you can do that. And then from this paper, I'm going to go ahead and stamp, or on my pre-punched um, piece here, you can go ahead and stamp in Tangerine Tango your acorn base. The Gold Glimmer Gorgeousness acorn cap has been punched for you, so go ahead and line that up there and again I think we need a Stampin' Dimensional between our acorns don't you? So we're going to layer that on there like that. One of the other things that's included here with your um, stamps in the mail club kit is this cute little acorn or leaf or acorn this will vary. These are from the Into the Woods Almonds and there's several different shapes. And I'm going to grab my fine tip glue. Um, you could use a mini glue dot or something like that for this too. And just pop some of that there on the back. Oh, I actually thought I had my acorns glued down, but I don't. Okay, I'm going to leave this open, but just for a second or two because I'm going to tie my bow. So your um, gold cording will be included in your kit. And you can tie your bow there. Okay, and cinch down the cinch down the ends because you want those little bow ends to be pretty petite so that they're kind of in line with their scale on the rest of our card. And then I'm going to let's see. Okay, this is floating around. I gotta stick it down. I'm gonna put a dimensional here so that I can stick our pieces down. Alright, there we go. And we glued our leaf already. So I can take my glue and put one more little drop here. And then go ahead and cap this again. So remember, hold your pieces all in one hand so that you can more efficiently line up your point. And then stick your glue bow down. Give it a couple seconds to grab. And through the magic of glue drying television, we have our acorn card already. Oh, totally forgot the point. So don't forget to add this little chevron piece here on your card just to sort of give it that extra little um, additional element. So if you would like to get your own Stamps in the Mail Club kit, make sure to drop me a note and request your kit on my website. And I look forward to stamping with you by mail. Happy stamping.